tal amigos? Muy buenas tardes, Irma Dio de su programa de Mujer a Mujer. Y hoy estamos en vivo desde la ciudad, Downtown Phoenix, en el lugar maravilloso de The Croft. Nadie, buenas tardes, ¿cómo estás? Hola, muy buenas tardes, Irma, muy bien y muy contenta de estar en, el, en este lugar tan hermoso en el que estamos en este momento. Así es, muchísimas gracias a todos ustedes que se conectan en estos momentos a su programa de Mujer a Mujer. Les tenemos preparado un programa increíble, un programa donde Roma, Roma llega a Phoenix. Y nada más y nada menos que aquí a The Craft, The Craft Downtown, un lugar realmente espectacular y más adelante vamos a tener la oportunidad de darles un poquito, un recorrido de lo que es el Craft Downtown de nuestros amigos Angela Carp y Mar, uh, Mark Carp. ¿Cómo estás, Angela? Good afternoon. Hello, welcome. Welcome to the Craft Downtown. I thought you speak Spanish. Mm -hmm. No, not, not, <laughs> not today. No, sorry. Well, first of all, thank you so much for having us. The more yes. and more it, it, uh, at this magnificent uh, place. This incredible exhibition, never been in Phoenix before. Yeah. Very, very excited. Thank you all for joining us this evening. It's wonderful. So tell us, tell us what, what is all this? I mean, the, 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 the chapel, the 16th chapel in Phoenix, yeah. what's going on? So very exciting. So we, um, you know, with traveling nowadays, you can't go to Rome. So we brought Rome to Phoenix. We have the Michelangelo's Sistine Chapel exhibit here at the Croft downtown. We have 34 beautiful life-size frescoes around our 10,000 square foot studio. Um, as you can see right back here is the Last Judgment. Um, you know, you go to the Sistine Chapel in Rome and it's very open the ceilings, everything's out of the way, whereas here you can get all up close and personal with it. You can take photographs here. Um, you can really get a true sense of, of the environment and just immerse yourself in this world. It kind of takes you away. And you actually do. When I, when I first uh, walked into the craft, uh, yeah. which you are going to tell us where you're at in yeah. a moment, it really feels like you're in Rome. But yeah. this is, este es el último juicio para todos ustedes que se acaban de conectar, el último juicio de la capilla uh, Sixtina que, eh, que está en la ciudad de Roma, en el Vaticano, y realmente es una experiencia increíble uh, para ustedes que han visitado la ciudad de Roma y que puedan tener la oportunidad de venir a The Craft Downtown. downtown. De verdad, esta es la única pieza que no es exactamente el tamaño original, pero todas las piezas que estamos viendo aquí en The Craft son exactamente una réplica de la copia original de, eh, de este gran pintor. Angela, where are you located so that people that are watching the show right now can find you and visit this ex exhibition? We have um, this warehouse is, as I say, it's nearly 17,000 square feet in total, and we're in downtown Phoenix. We're on First Street and Buchanan, right on the corner. And we're just down from the ballpark. So um, we have parking down here as well. So we make it very easy for you and lots of signage outside to find us. So we are, as I say, a large warehouse with dripping chandeliers in here and um, some beautiful church pews to sit on and just really take it all in, all these absolute beautiful frescoes. This is beautiful. Nay, yo no sé si tú tuviste la oportunidad más a uh, cuando recién llegamos. Eh, estamos exactamente en lo que es la ciudad, el downtown de Phoenix. Estamos muy cerca de lo que es el estadio de béisbol. Eh, estamos prácticamente una cuadra. El, el, the Craft está localizado en una zona donde es muy fácil de encontrar también el estacionamiento. How long is this exhibition going to be in Phoenix? So we started this week and uh, we will be closed tomorrow. Um, but other than that, uh, we will be here till February 14th, till Valentine's Day. So we will be closed on a Tuesday, but open six days a week from 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. And you're talking about 17,000 square foot. Yes. And we see this beautiful pictures around the craft. Yeah. Are we going to be able to see all of that and people can take pictures? Something that you cannot do at the Vatican. You just can't do it. Um, you don't have crowds here. You don't have lines. You can really just sit here and take it in. Um, as I say, it is time ticketing, so you can come in 
and you, you're just going to be in your own world here. It's, it's just so in incredible and for something to do, you know, we know that there's a lot of things that have been cancelled, so it's wonderful to bring the, the family all here, find things to do and, you know, show the children this. I mean, this is, it's, we, we encourage you to bring the family. This is a must-see exhibition. Absolutely. And, and, and talking about nothing to do in the city, Angela, you're absolutely yes. right. And yes. you guys are keeping the safety first. Absolutely. What are you guys doing about that? So we do check temperatures um, just like you would going into restaurants. And um, we do require masks at all times and just, you know, social distancing, just, you know, be respectful. But um, again, because of the, the size of the space, um, we, we feel that we've got everything under control and we really want everybody to have a wonderful experience. Here. Absolutely. Naye, esta es una exhibición que solamente se ha llevado a las ciudades y a los países más grandes en Latinoamérica. Por ejemplo, ellos ya estuvieron en Panamá, también estuvieron en la Ciudad de México, la Ciudad de Mex México City, también estuvieron en Texas, pero para que nosotros tengamos una exhibición como esta de verdad, es realmente un verdadero lujo. Y te voy a decir algo, Naye, eh, ellos están siguiendo con todas las reglas de seguridad uh, antes de entrar, como ya no lo decía Angela, ellos toman la temperatura, se aseguran de que la gente eh, traiga su, su cubrebocas y así de esa manera todo el mundo se sienta tranquilo. Algo que no puedes hacer tampoco en la Capilla Sixteen en, en el Vaticano es, es tomar fotografías, algo que, que es fascinante porque realmente las pinturas aquí que está en esta exhibición son exactamente una réplica, excepto la que estamos viendo uh, detrás de nosotros, Naye, esto por su tamaño obviamente es un poco más pequeña, pero eh, realmente una experiencia que invitamos a todos ustedes a que vengan y visiten lo que es el Craft Downtown. Uh, give us the address again, Angela. It's 22 East Buchanan Street, and that's Phoenix. What are the cross streets uh, here? Uh, Buchanan and First Street. Bueno, es muy fácil, ¿no? Eh, primera calle y Buchanan's. Eh, Naye, ¿cómo estamos por allá? Tenemos algunas preguntas de la audiencia. Si usted eh, quiere experimentar algo de lo que es la capilla... Uh, uh, de verdad y, y que no ha podido o, te, o no, no puede tener la oportunidad de ir a visitar Roma, bueno, esta es su oportunidad y, re, y realmente yo tuve la oportunidad de estar en, en el Vaticano Naye, y, y de verdad se siente que estamos en el Vaticano aquí, aquí en Phoenix ah, como lo decía el, el anuncio eh, antes, estamos Roma llegó a Phoenix, ¿no? ¿De ¿Qué te parece Naya? ¿Ya tienes alguna pregunta tú? No, solamente comentarios dice uh, Gloria Guerra dice, what, what an amazing Exhibition. It is an amazing, amazing exhibition. Y, y vamos Thank a... you for bringing this to the, uh, to this to the state up and great time for un unity for our beautiful community. There you go. Bueno, uh, Angela, um, you told us about the exhibition that is going to be here uh, not, not only this month, but it's going to be extended all the way to February. Correct. And is, is there a cost for that? Yes, there is. Um, it is on the website. Uh, we do encourage you to go to um, chapelsistine.com. That's where you can purchase tickets um, on the date that you want to come, the time ticketing, um, so, and it tells you all the pricing. There is a reduced price for families, there's individual pricing, there's pricing for seniors, but it, it does list that all on the site. We also, um, if you want to come and buy tickets here, we, we also do that too, as well. We also have um, gift certificates as well, which is a wonderful gift to give to somebody. It, it could know? be a wonderful gift, especially really Christmas does. is coming. Yes. Si usted quiere hacer un regalo realmente tan maravilloso como es, ir a visitar una exhibición como esta, bueno, también cuentan con certificados, también puede comprar sus boletos. And um, you, you said that you can purchase tickets on the website. You can. Uh, what is the website? Yes, it's Chapel Sistine. And we're, uh, vamos a ponerle la información, vamos a poner la dirección de la página web donde usted puede ir a visitar y también comprar sus boletos o también los certificados, si así lo desea. Naye, yo no sé a ti qué te parece, has tenido la oportunidad ya de ver un poquito más de lo que es la exhibición, pero realmente el ambiente eh, se siente eh, muy bonito. Yo sé, yo sé que mucha gente a lo mejor aquí en Phoenix no es muy religiosa o mucha gente sí lo es y, y de verdad se siente una paz y una tranquilidad. 
tranquilidad maravillosa que definitivamente los invitamos a todos ustedes a que vengan y visiten esta exhibición y, y también no solamente a uh, ayudar a lo que es, como decía Ángela, ahorita no hay muchos eventos aquí en la ciudad, sino también ayudar a la economía un poquito, ¿verdad? Así es, dice, fíjate que dice Mari Naguel que ella tuvo la oportunidad de admirarlo en el Vaticano y es extraordinario, dice que muchas gracias por traerlo aquí a Phoenix, Arizona. Muchísimas gracias a ti. Y sí, esa es la idea de que ahora que lo tenemos nosotros aquí en Phoenix, también ustedes, los que no han tenido la oportunidad de visitarlo en el Vaticano, bueno, pues tengan la oportunidad de experimentar esta maravillosa obra. ¿Algo más, Naye? No, Gloria dice que muchas gracias por traer esto y que dice que la transporta a la paz. Sí, it's transporting everybody to giving them some peace, right? Oh, <laughs> which we need it. I need it. We really need that right now. And it, it really does. And even for something, you know, I'm, I'm in here every day. I can tell you when I walk in, it just has this, it's just this feeling that goes through you that just gives us this peace that we really, really need right now. And, and you, una cosa bien importante, Angela, and we were talking about this earlier, the, the whole exhibition is in English and Spanish as Absolutely. well. Absolutely. You have a translation, but also yeah. um, you were telling me more details about when you are the experience coming into the exhibition. Yeah, so when, when you come in, um, we can either help you download an app onto your phone or we do have some headsets as well. And so it's either in Spanish or English. So it's really an experience like if you were at the Vatican. Absolutely, absolutely. And then as you say, at every fresco, we have the signage here that tells you again in English and in Spanish all about each actual piece as well. Angela, yeah. what your experience as a, a business owner and, and, and being at the craft for so long, uh, what is your experience so far with this exhibition? I mean, this is something yeah. completely new for you guys. Yeah, absolutely delighted. You know, with all of this, you know, of course, we are a venue. We do weddings, we do parties. Um, that, is, that is what we've done for six years. And when the pandemic happened and we got shut down, then we just had to get creative. It's like, okay. So I picked up the phone and called the company in LA that had this and said, you know, we'd love to have you in Phoenix. Everybody was, would love to come and embrace you and support us, small business. And uh, we just, uh, we can't even tell you how delighted we were that we, we actually managed to get this downtown Phoenix. Well, we're very honored to be in your, not only at your, at your place, which is huge. I never, I never thought it was this big. I knew it was big, but it's yeah. pretty huge. And yeah. like, like como, como les estaba diciendo yo anteriormente, realmente es una experiencia increíble venir a lo que es el, el, el craft y más ahorita que tiene esta magnífica exhibición. Y como decía Ángela, hay momento eh, de pandemia donde te tienes que inventar y tienes que hacer todo lo que tengas que hacer para, eh, eh, para salir adelante, ¿verdad? Uh, ellos eh, se dedican a hacer bodas, eh, eventos y ahorita una gran exhibición en un lugar tan maravilloso como lo es el craft. And, and I, I'm agreeing with you. I was just doing a little bit of translation to our audience. Uh, what's your favorite piece uh, of this exhibition so far? You know, that's like asking me what my favorite child is. That's really difficult to answer. It is. Because everyone in itself, you go and you, you, the more that you look at it and the more you go back into it, you see different things and you appreciate everything. I think that it's really difficult. You to, want to talk uh, to the audience about this particular one? Yeah, so, um, so we know that Michelangelo, he was up in... Um, so I was, uh, I was told that's heaven. Yeah, that's, that's right. That's where we're at, yeah. we're in heaven. Yeah, and, and then can you see him in here? Because he right is here. painted. Right here. There you go. Right here. That's right. So that, that's also fun for the children to come in and see. Cause so it's tell, us, tell us what we're looking at. If, if Naya, if you can um, uh, point the camera to this particular image right here, uh, what are we looking at? So this is, so he painted himself in here, is kind of the grumpy old man kind of thing that he's The one that is hanging? Here. Yeah, that, that he is. He doesn't look very happy when... Uh, this is, uh, when you go to the Vatican, and you've been at the Vatican, and, Vatican City. and, and, and yeah. it, 
it's really an amazing piece and what you guys put together here yeah. because this is this is identical yeah this is so real so this is the smallest piece though every all the other frescoes are pretty much kind of the life size this piece is is not true to size but that'll tell you about it over there because it, it just takes over a large area which obviously we couldn't do in this piece but we put it kind of front and center um, because there's just so much to see in here and you could literally sit here for hours and, and angela all these replicas have been permitted absolutely yes they're all permits and you know we we we've been given that from the vatican they know it's here so um we've had our blessing with that um and also we've uh, we've had many different people already in in one week it's amazing the people that have have come through and and heard about it and we've had um some priests come in there was they had a a little morning out together and came to see it and they were just so excited in awe and they're actually uh what did he say about the exhibition they, they they just were delighted and and felt that it was done correctly that they were it they were just felt so excited and and they're actually going to come back um and apparently they're bringing just a whole group because you've got to come and see it for yourself because even you know seeing it now on camera it, it it's you've got different. to walk it's in, not the same you? It, you'd really do and as i say they were they were just so delighted and excited about it that angela i've done so many events with you and mark and yeah. you guys are always amazing but this yeah. is definitely something completely different and, and, yeah. and it, like you said it's so beautiful de verdad si usted no ha tenido la oportunidad de visitar ninguna de estas obras de, de Miguel Ángel bueno esta es la oportunidad está en Phoenix está va a estar aquí por varios meses y vamos a estar uh, vamos a estar uh, más adelante dándoles toda la información también ahí en los mensajes eh, en los mensajes aquí en el teléfono Naya hay alguna pregunta de la audiencia que nos quieras eh, que, que nos quieras mostrar Bueno, uh, something that we forgot, uh, is there a phone number, Angela, where people can ask questions? Yes, of course. Um, so, well, there's two things as well. I was going to say that if you go on our Instagram, The Croft Downtown, you can also go to the bio that's on the Instagram, and that takes you straight through. It gives you more details about the exhibit. So if you can't remember Chapel Sistine, just go to The Croft Downtown, Look at the bio, and you can also purchase tickets. There and and you well. know what? The audience wants to know the address one more time. Yes. So uh, it's First uh, Street, right? Yes. So it's 22 East Buchanan Street. Ahí está la información. Uh, número 22 es el Buchanan Street. Está muy cerca del estadio de los Diamondbacks. Eh, es facilísimo llegar aquí y el estacionamiento también es muy fácil. La exhibición es realmente algo que no se pueden perder. Eh, yo he estado en, en, en el Vaticano también y, y cuando entré al Craft, eh, es increíble lo que han hecho con esta obra. Y tenerla en Phoenix, yo creo que es un agasajo. Yeah. Uh, Angela, the, did we forget anything? Number. So the phone number is 602-462-9700. And that is the number if you have any questions at all, you can, you can call us and we'd be happy to help you. We have a very interesting message here. Um, 38.1% de Arizona son personas religiosas. Es cierto, Gloria, eh, en, en Arizona hay muchísima gente eh, religiosa, independientemente eh, de la religión que sea, no importa la religión, venir a experimentar lo que es el Sixteen Chapel, lo que es eh, la Capilla 16, es increíble y es algo que independientemente cuál sea su religión, se los re super recomendamos. Angela, what about if we start walking a little bit and experience yeah. some of this? And, and you can be talking, the, the camera is going to be capturing most of these uh, beautiful paintings. Okay. And, and you can tell us a little bit about it or you can just keep on repeating the information for us so that we, the audience can see what we are looking at right Absolutely. now. Absolutely. So, I mean, just to, by walking around, you can see the scale about looking at the height of us here. And you've mentioned it incredible. several times that this is the actual size. Right, exactly. Of the original picture. And, and then you can also put your 
um, camera on here as well and then it all just brings it up this is all the information and as I say it's a, every fresco in here I feel like, like I'm that. in in Rome don't you I know we we're finally traveling again we're finally wonderful? traveling again and we're in COVID still right. I know and this one particularly I happen to remember and, and, and like I said earlier, Angela, when you go to the Vatican, it's so overwhelming because everything is so beautiful. Well, you get to see it here and actually I'm enjoying it even more. I know, I know. It, it really is. I mean, as I say, and, and the nice thing is that you can take photos as well. You know, there's so many opportunities that you can take with family as well, the photos we have over here. What do we have? Um, you can see that there's a photo opportunity area we have gift store in here, so it's great little pieces in here. But come on into the, come on over. I'm following. The, I, I got a little distracted by the I pictures know, back there. It's, it's really unbelievable what you are going to get to experience here. Uh, the craft, the craft downtown, uh, 22 uh, Buchanan's. Estamos prácticamente en la primera avenida y la Buchanan's. Estamos muy cerca. Para si usted se quiere identificar, estamos muy cerca de lo que es el estadio, el estadio de los Diamondbacks. Um, like I said, Angela, this is this is no. so beautiful. It's something that I I wish everybody really, really can get to enjoy it, and, and it's, it's plenty of time. So where where are we walking to? So now this room we call the Abbey. This so is the Abbey. Now you're walking into the Abbey. Okay. Wow. This is oh. unbelievable, and this is one of my. My favorite spots of the craft. I know, I know. Este es uno de mis lugares favoritos yes. del craft yes. porque aquí es donde ellos hacen cuando tienen sus eventos. Esta es la capilla donde hacen la celebración de las bodas. Esta es una this imagen is, muy this particular. This is this is one of the yes. favorite ones, so right? So what you have to do, Amara, is you come over here and put your hand to moment. Put our hand. There we go. Ahí está la mano. Es una de las fotos más famosas de lo que es. Eh, la Capilla Sixteen en, en el Vaticano y muchos de ustedes, yo sé, aquí tenemos también a nuestra biblioteca andando que es Araceli, Araceli Duarte, que yo me imagino que tú estás fascinada con todo lo que estás viendo tú has leído muchísimo de la historia y me imagino que en estos momentos lo estás disfrutando al igual que nosotros, ¿verdad Araceli? Sí, mucho <laughs> So that's kind of fun to do as well and did, did you think Angela, he did like a real pictures of this? Mm -hmm. or, yeah. or what was what's he real with the picture yeah oh yeah okay yeah. I'm talking uh, yeah. I'm being very particular on, yeah. on, on what we are looking at yeah no everything and then in this room as well you, you can kind of feel it what's so exciting for us to have all of this in here but this particular side of the building is over 50 years old and it's got the big wood bow trust ceilings so it kind of mimics the church and we've had this room blast as well because this is where we usually conduct uh wedding ceremonies in here so um it's it's truly a special special place let be honest with me don't you want to keep some of these pictures for like I ever do. for the craft <laughs> i do i absolutely do we're having a wedding here um, are they going to get to enjoy some of this? They are getting married in the Sistine Chapel. How about that? So, bueno, ahí está la oportunidad también. Si yeah. usted se va a casar muy pronto, hay la oportunidad de que si lo hace de aquí a febrero, bueno, puede tener la oportunidad de estar eh, casándose yeah. en, en la capilla uh, Sixtina. Yeah. Angela, this this room particularly is very very special. And you were saying it about how it was being it's being blessed, and that's where normally all the ceremonies happen. Yes. But today it has a different feeling. It has a different feeling. That's as I say, you just walk in and have to experience it for yourself. It just the calming, the just I I it's it's very hard to put into words what it does for you. I remember the first time I was at the um, Capilla Sixtina. Eh, tuve la oportunidad y me parecía eh, increíble todo lo que yo estaba viendo, pero volverlo a ver, pero verlo a una magnitud donde realmente tú casi puedes tocar las fotografías, de verdad que es una experiencia bien diferente a lo que se vive en el Vaticano, donde está la, la pintura original y, y realmente lo que decía Angela temprano, eh, es una experiencia que no se pueden perder. Angela, You've been at the, at the at, at, in Rome, and you've yes. been at the Chapel 16, and, and yes. this is different. This feels so yeah. 
Well, so, it's for us. So real. And it's for us. You and know? it's for us. It's for us. It, it, it's in Phoenix. It's special. It just, you know, we're, we're blessed that we, that we managed to get it here. We, there was a reason for it. So you can't miss this because we feel that we're very fortunate to have this. There's other cities that really wanted it, but we just kept working hard. To, to get this back for us. So well, thank you so delighted. much for having us and thank you for bringing this exhibition into Phoenix. Uh, if, if I can stay here and spend the night, I, I think <laughs> I could and, 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 and read every single of these pictures. Yeah, and, and also as well, I mean, we, we are still doing events here as well. So, that so the venue is not close. So the venue itself, Yes, on the after hours, we can also do more weddings. We can host parties here. So just keep that in mind if, if there's something, you know, that you, that you want to celebrate, basically. You can have your own private dinner party in here. Ahí está. Si quiere un lugar donde hacer su eh, cena especial, usted puede tenerlo con la exhibición de lo que es la Capilla Sixtina. Y Angela, I'm, I'm impressed. You guys did an amazing job. Thank uh, everything you. looks amazing. Yes. I just want everybody to have the opportunity to enjoy this. Yes. Something? Did we forget anything? I don't think so. Just love to see you. Naye, olvidamos alguna uh, otra pregunta de la audiencia? Algo que se nos uh, haya olvidado? Eh, se... Quieren saber eh, la dirección, la... el costo. Uh, the address again, Angela, and, and uh, the cost. Yes, it's 22 East Buchanan Street, and that's Phoenix, 85004. So it's on Buchanan Street and First Street, but you will enter the gates on First Street. It is signposted there, and the parking is just off First Street, but it is all signposted for you, so you'll get that. Bueno, eh, ha sido realmente un honor haber estado aquí en The Craft, The Craft Downtown. Uh, muchísimas gracias, Angela, Angela Carp, Mark Carp, por habernos tenido a sus, a sus amigas de Mujer a Mujer. Vamos a estarles dando más información sobre esta exhibición que realmente es maravillosa, una experiencia que les invitamos a todos ustedes a que tengan la oportunidad de venir y disfrutarla. El, el ambiente eh, te hace sentir como si estuvieras realmente en Roma. Naye, uh, si no tienes alguna pregunta, nos vamos a retirar. Eh, vamos a poner la información nuevamente, se los repito, aquí debajo del programa para que ustedes sepan a dónde ir a comprar sus boletos, cuánto es el costo y para si usted quiere hacer un regalo especial. Bueno, como lo dijo Ángela, también lo puede hacer con uh, gift cards, ¿verdad? Ángela, anything Thank else? You. No, I this think is your moment. This is this is it. I just would love to see you. So come on down. There's there's plenty for everybody to do down here. Well, Lovely. thank you so much. Irma thank Tío, you. muchísimas gracias. Naye, como siempre, ha sido un honor haber compartido los micrófonos contigo. A todo nuestro equipo, a Juan García de The One Decor, también Araceli, Araceli Silva Duarte, muchísimas gracias. También tenemos a Alberto por allá detrás de cámaras. Muchísimas gracias por habernos acompañado a www.martallamas.com. Muchísimas gracias. Y a todos ustedes, nuestra audiencia, muchísimas gracias por habernos acompañado en su programa de Mujer a Mujer.